Hey everybody, Wayne's Beer Delivery. Back delivering another beer review. So, got a pretty interesting beer. It's called Bethania. It's a dark lager from Full Steam Brewery in Durham, North Carolina. This beer is brewed with 100% North Carolina malt. It says it's malty, roasty, and smooth. Looks like 5.5% ABV. And it is a Czech style dark, dark lager. I know it says 100% North Carolina malt. It looks like um, these Czech Zaz hops, Epiphany Bittersweet, Epiphany Smooth Authorator, Epiphany Brew Malt, Epiphany Old Faction, Epiphany Brewer's Breakfast Malt, and the River Bend's Plow to Pint Pills. That's the one thing I do love about Full Steam is they do their best to support local. Um, everything that they try to use is either in North Carolina or the Southeastern region. Uh, River Bend Malt House. I know that they get a lot of their malts from there. And I got this beard right from the head brewer at Full Steam. His name is John. John Simpson, I think. And um, I ran into him and into uh, Sean Lily Wilson, the owner of Full Steam at the Southern Lager Invitational in Asheville. So, you know, let's crack this open, pour it out, and see what we're working with. Get that cascade action. This one does look dark. But the head's kind of big, so let's uh, let it settle. Be back in a minute. So while, you, while we're waiting for it to settle, look at the can art on this. Everything looks like, you know, dealing with farming. Then also I noticed this is a good food awards finalist for 2024 and then if you see right there you do have a QR code to learn more about Bethania so I would definitely check it out let's check on the beer all right as you can see in our be hoppy glass very dark can barely see my finger through it nice dark roasty color nice tan head hmm Smells like a dark chocolatey malt bomb. So to Sean Lilly Wilson, to John Simpson, and the guys and gals at Full Steam Brewing, cheers. Mm. Wow. Oh, wow. I'm definitely digging this this has got all the robustness of like a good porter without the harsh mouthfeel um, definitely some very good bready biscuit undertones a nice almost a chocolate taste to it Maybe a bit of that coffee taste without having the coffee taste, if that makes any sense. Hats off to you guys. <laughs> this is a phenomenal beer. I wish I just had more than one can. So I will definitely be enjoying this. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for tuning in. For those longtime subscribers, thanks for hanging in there. 
And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Ladies and gents, cheers, and keep drinking those good beers.